Hey guys, welcome to another unboxing video. Today, I'll be opening up a two packages actually. The first package, the one in front of you, is going to be a supply package for like card sleeves and that kind of thing. And then the second package is um, something I ordered from the Japanese Pokemon Center a few months ago. So, I'm very excited to see what I ordered because at this point I kind of forgot. So let's open up the, the first box. Okay. Let's see what we have here. Ooh, very excited. Okay, so let's see. Let's take these bubbles away. So first things first, we have a bunch of soft card sleeves from Vault X. This is my first time using Vault X, so I'm not super sure the quality. But hey, I'll let you know. I'll let you guys know if it's worth it or if it's not. Let's put that on the side. Second thing, or the other thing in the box, is going to be some semi-rigid card holders. Let's see. Yeah, there it is, Vault-X semi-rigid card, hold card holders. I got 200 and it was about like, I think it was $25. Yeah, so there we are. So Vault-X semi-rigids and card sleeves. And of course... We have our Pokemon Center box, and I think for the event, or when, when I bought it, they had ooh, some cool packaging. It's like huge, but let me, ooh, let me open this up for you. First, we have a huge plushie, and I think at the time that I bought it, all the plushies were sold out of the Evolutions. For, I forgot what this is called, the, the super fluffy collection or whatever. But look at look at this boy. Look at this boy. So this is how he looks. Hell heck of fluffy. My boy Jolteon. He can sit on his side without falling over. And got a little pamphlet. Yeah. So this is the first item. Okay. Ooh. I think what are these keychains? I'm not even sure. Okay, this one's definitely Marnie, 100%. Let's see. Let's see, yep, it's Marnie. Okay, I think it is a, yeah, it, it is a keychain. Nice, so we got a Marnie keychain as well. As, I can't remember. She was the main character from Pokemon Ruby Sapphire. I can't seem to remember her name, but Got a second keychain. If anyone can, t if anyone knows how to speak Japanese, can let me know what what both of these names are in Japanese. That would be really appreciated. So we got two awesome keychains. Got a bunch of different sleeves. I think ordered like a bunch of like different um, sleeves with cool art. Yep. So first things first. Ooh, let's go. We got the really cute, I think a Rizu, yeah, eating a Onigiri, as well as an Apom and a Teddy Ursa. Really love the art on this. Okay, let's see, what else did I get? Ooh, let's go, the whole Gardevoir line. Got the Ralts, Curlia, and Gardevoir. Look at that. Okay, ooh, yes, Paldi and Wooper. Really love the color scheme, really relaxing, soothing colors we got okay yeah let's go got the pokemon trainer got rowlet over there send quill and oshawa definitely pokemon arceus pokemon arceus vibes we got another gardevoir another pokemon arceus kind of vibes and more whooper yep so let's put this in the back oh got a bunch of these cool Sleeves and we all, I think I also got this battle deck. Yeah, it's a battle deck, comes with a awesome Mimikyu EX, and then I think it comes with one promo that could be one of these four cards, and one of them is another EX. Kind of cool, pretty chill. I'm gonna keep it sealed for now because I don't really, I'm not really into the card game, but if I ever do, I'm gonna crack this open and Make a cool deck. Got some pens. I think. 
Oh, are these? Ooh. Let's see. Ooh, each of these have, I don't know if you can see it. It's a tiny little totodile. Totodile on the pen. And and then let's see what we got. We got three. Some of these pens. Green, green ones. Green pen. Let's see what Pokemon they are. I don't know if you can see it. It's, this is right here. We have whatever the heck these are. I am not 100% sure. I have a hunch. I have a hunch. I think these are the card stands I, I had. And then we got a bunch of cards. And we got ourselves some Yunabe Pokemon card games. These uh, these packs I'll open up for another video, but we have should be 20 of them. 10 here, 10 here. That's cool. So first, let's open up this little package. Okay. Ooh. Yes, I was right. These are really amazing card frames. My God, look at the look at the glitter. So I think I had two of these. Okay, and then I got uh, another two that were also really cool. I love them because. Uh, you have the, the the fire, water, and grass starter themes. Got Oshawa, Rowlet, Cyndaquil. I think this was another Pokemon Arceus themed thing. And then you can see on the edges, all the elements like the blades of grass, um, balls of water, and the flames. Okay, so I got those four. Put this on the side. Last but not least, this mysterious package. I think I also ordered off of, of an online card shop for singles or for, for, for the most re more recent sets like Scarlet, Violet, Triple Beat, uh, was a Snow Hazard and Clayburst. So and, and I, I combined uh, combined the shipping. So these I don't think yeah these are not from uh, the Pokemon Center Jap Japan. These are from another online card shop. Card shop. Okay, so we got. Bunch of singles that purchased. If I remember correctly, this was about fifty-ish bucks. Let's see what, which singles I bought. Let's open both of them first. As you can see, you have a mischievous, mischievous in the front. Okay, let's stack them real quick. So first card we have a Mario. Then we got Dunsparce, but let's see, is this a single card? Ooh, I was always doubting the condition, but the condition is pretty good. I'm only, for, I'm only using putting my binder for now. Slight wear on the sides, a tiny bit, but looking good. Love the art. So for some reason, underwater themes always get me. This reminds me of like a beach or gives me, uh, you know those tide pools or like those little, or when you go to an aquarium and have these little, uh, small pools with starfishes and stuff. This gives me reminds me of, of that. We got Dunsparce. Oh my god, look at that. Dedene, little scatterbugs. Then we got Pacharisu. Pacharisu, hella cute. Had to get it, had to get that. We got, ooh, for Coco. In a shopping, shopping for little snacks. We got, ooh, that's the, yeah, roll. It's in my previous video. Uh, I opened, or oh, I bought the Gardevoir, Gardevoir uh, version off TCG Player because it was slightly cheaper off off that of there than the Japanese website. But I got Ralts from the Japanese website this time, slightly cheaper and quality seemed much better. We got Mouse. I can't remember their name because I'm not really well versed in the new eras, so many new Pokemon. But oh, Mouse Hold, I think. Hello, cool. My favorite is this uh, this one right here with the little mushroom hat. We got ooh, we got this young fellow grabbing a bunch of shiny crystals in a cave. Got the evolved now. 
She has a huge hammer. She looks kind of mad too. We got Tyranitar. Let's go. Godzilla vibes. Oh, we got the look at the bird. The bird in a garden. There you go, Mischievous. I love, love the framing of this art. Perfectly in a circle. Giving you abandoned house, abandoned manor. It's kind of like, you know, Pokemon Diamond and Pearl or Platinum. That manor in Eternal City where you get Rotom. That's that that's the vibe that it's giving me right now. Ooh, we got Wiglet. Wiglet. Oh my god. Love the love disc. As I said, water-themed cards art or water-themed art always gets me. There you go. Curlia. Evolved version of the Rolls we saw earlier. There it is. Yeah. Look at this. Art, love it. We got ooh, look at this man's definitely and took inspiration from a whale, bro. Okay. We got ooh, Starly, Starly. How are they all how are they all able to sit on stand on that one little tree branch? Pretty cool. Ryolu. <laughs> it's oblivious. <laughs> the mess you made after the trainer comes back. Ooh, we got ooh clauncher, clauncher, and if you notice, it'll be a little scrub right here, just chilling. We got a ooh, it looks like a little mushroom, except it's if it feels rock. We got ooh, let's go sandy gas on a playground. With the, I really love like the um, contrast and lighting, so this this art really got my attention. Okay, we got Fletchling, I think. Sitting by a campfire. And lastly, we got a sleeping Raichu. Yep, so that's pretty much it, guys. This is my Pokemon um, opening for the Japanese boxes. If you guys like my videos, please like, please like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.